Zaku Baruch. Good morning to everyone. Bezat Hashem in Ha is going to be 7.55. Please be on time. Continuing in the Arachot of Muktzeh, we are discussing uh, toys for kids. Are toys for kids in general Muktzeh? So the vast majority of toys are not Muktzeh for kids to play with on Shabbat. There are only two major exceptions. First exception is obviously going to be electric toys. Toys that need to work through electricity uh, is a problem. So for example, they have this uh, memory toy where there's four lights and the lights turn on and you have to remember the exact pattern and press the buttons. Those types of toys are clearly going to be asul even for kids, even kids that are young, three, four, five. You should start training them from a very young age to keep Shabbat. If they're two and sometimes even three years old, depending on the kid, it could be that they're allowed to play with it because they don't understand anything about Shabbat. They don't get it. They don't understand the concept of Shabbat. You don't have to stop them from playing with it. But once a kid turns uh, three sometimes, or and certainly four or five, you have to teach them not to play with such toys on Shabbat. That's exception number one. Exception number two is toys that might not be electric, but their usage is by making uh, noise. As an example, let's say a guitar, a string guitar. To have a child play with that, he would not be allowed to because that, again, is something that is asul to do on Shabbat, to play musical instruments on Shabbat. Even if it's not electric, is a different reason it's asul, but it's also asul. One thing that is important to know, sometimes you have toys that you could play with them. They are electric toys, but you don't need the electric part to play with them. So let's say a lot of times these kids, they have like a choo-choo train which uh, you could press a button and then it makes a nice noise and it continues to drive and then it stops and you press it again and it continues. You can still play with that on Shabbat, meaning they don't press the button, they just want to play with the train. It would be allowed to be done because they're not using the electricity component of it and they're just using it in a permissible way, which at the end of the day, it's, it's a toy, it's a train. So they could play with that. Or anything that's similar to that, sometimes they have these action figures where you could press a button and then they make a noise, uh, or you could not and just play with it, those things would be permitted, even though it does have an electric capacity inside of it, but because it could be played without the electricity, therefore it is uh, permitted for a child to play with such cho- toys, and it's not considered to be muktzeh. Amen